Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm back with the remaining month of October reads. This reading is going to be for the sign of Aquarius. So let's see what is coming up for Aquarians for the remaining month time. I will be adding vocal cards in this reading plus we will be also adding messages from your person as well. So stay tuned and now before I dive into the read, let me remind you it is a general reading if and it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages that resonate and leave the rest. And now... Uh, for personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out all the services that I offer as well in the description box. So yeah, let's see, Aquarians, what can you expect for the remaining month's time? Let's dive into the read and let's begin. King of Pentacles, I do see you feeling very stable in this uh, remaining month's time. You might be attracting a lot of financial stability in your life, uh, or, 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 or opportunities to uh, to uh, create financial stability for yourself. Um, but I feel like you know there is a lot happening. Uh, for some of you, you might be staying very busy with your work in this uh, remaining month time. Um, and if that's the case, I feel like you know there is a strong possibility of it affecting your love life or other ways of your life because you would be you would be feeling kind of stuck with the with the responsibilities that you have on your shoulder because of your work scenarios. Uh, let's see more cards here. Um, the High Priestess, the Hermit, Ten of Swords. Yep, I feel like you, know, you will be having a lot of uh, busy, busy time uh, in this uh, remaining month time. It seems like you know, it's going to be a time where you are going to find very hard for yourself to find time for yourself even. So uh, there is a strong possibility of you picking up arguments, fights with your person, um, plus uh, feeling bad about the current situation as well, uh, where you would not be able to do the things that you want to do. Spending time with the family, spending time with the one for yourself. But yes, I feel like you know a lot of responsibilities and lack of uh, emotional satisfaction is going to be the thing for you for the remaining month time. Um, I do see that... Um, you you might be trying to um you know it's it's more of uh, that thing where since you would not be able to be talking to your person uh if there is a specific someone in your life uh that you want to connect to that you want to talk to i feel like you know you might be communicating to them whatever it is that you're going through through telepathic messages now when i say telepathic messages i don't see that you would be sitting and sending out some telepathic messages to that person it's going to be more of a situation where you're going to feel like you know i wish i could talk to them and the moment you wish that your person could have a flash of you there so the energies could be completely reversed for some of you maybe it's the energy of your person maybe the person that you are dealing with they are stuck in their life right now and they would not be able to give you enough time which is going to bother you and if that's happening and if you have been picking up flashes of your person um you know doing you know doing uh, you know sitting or doing nothing you you have your person's flash it, it's going to be because uh, they are trying to talk to you they want to talk to you but they are unable to do so something is happening in their life in that situation which is uh, kind of you know keeping them stuck and they really want you to know that they are missing you for sure let's see more cards here Four of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles. For some of you, they might be busy with a lot of people. Uh, now they can be. These people could be their friends. They, these people could be. Maybe they are having some sort of a, um um work-related meetings or something. They could be having family gatherings. But there is something to do with a lot of people. That's the reason why they are unable to find time for you. So, yes, I feel like you know, there is going to be a lack of communication for you and your person in the remaining month time, which is definitely going to be affecting you badly. Um, I feel like, you know, for the majority of you, maybe you are going to be on the receiving end of the situation where your person is not going to be talking to you and it is definitely going to affect you in a negative way. Not just you, but your person as well, because I feel like, you know, your person is unhappy as well. That's the reason why they are wishing and hoping that they could talk to you, that they could communicate to you, but somehow they will not be finding enough time to do so. Uh, they might be 24-7 with the, uh, you know, someone else. So the someone else could be another person in their life. It can be a group of people, as I mentioned earlier. So yeah, but yes, they will be missing you, I feel like. Let's see more cards here. Two of Swords. Queen of Wands. Knight of uh, Wands. This person has a strange pull for you, for sure. So whether 
they talk to you or not, but they do think about you a lot. They would want to take action towards you, you know. Maybe they would not be able to do that. They would not be able to take action towards you, but they would love to. So there is a lot of uh, attraction that they have for you. Um, but yes, uh, I feel like you know, the people's influence is heavier than anything else there. Um, they would not be able to find a way to, to reach out to you. They would be missing you. They would be thinking about you. They would be stressed with the current situation. But yes, they will uh, be unable to kind of you know, reach out to you. Let's see their messages for you. What else do they want you to know? Ten of Wands, they really want you to know that there is something shitty going on in their life. They really want to get done with it so they could approach you to, so they could reach out to you. But right now, for some of you, maybe a person is traveling away from home. So now that, else, uh, that too could be something which is kind of, you know, not letting this person talk to you more because maybe they are staying out with someone else right now. So maybe that's the reason why they are finding it hard to communicate to you or stay in touch with you. Um, they really want you to know that wait on for me uh don't think that i am uh you know um mad at you for something or i'm not ready to talk to you or something i really want to just that i'm stuck with something uh nine of souls i feel like you know this person or you yourself could have been having a uh, sleepless nights as well again because of the same reason you are unable to talk to your person and that is definitely getting uh you know you upset and your person upset as well so let's see what the oracle has to add to the read Prosperity lies ahead. So you have basically nothing to worry around. Just that you need to be patient. Expect powerful change. Uh, for some of you, you could be dealing with the Taurus as well. Uh, and try to, you know, stay positive and expect something beautiful to come out of the situation. Uh, nothing will come out of the situation. Um, the void between the two of you is going to end soon. So if you are, you know, contemplating and overthinking, overanalyzing situations right now, that you're having with your person nothing is going to come out of it try to keep yourself positive that way because whatever it is that you're thinking around it's it's nothing there's no reality to that because your person is stuck somewhere maybe you are thinking that maybe they are happy without you or this and that so try not to get there try to stay positive try to believe that something abundant is going to come through from your person's end uh, towards you towards this connection so try to keep yourself positive that way let's see more oracle guidance Romantic feelings, your feelings are real and worth exploring. So you do have romantic feelings for each other. For some of you, you could be in a third party situation where your person is either married or committed to someone else. And then there is a connection that they have with you as well. Let's see more cards here. Trust, the situation is calling for you to have faith. Now, if there is a third party situation, your person would not be lying to you. They would make you know if there is the case. That's what it is. But Yes, they do have romantic feelings for you and yes, you can trust this person because they are not going to lie to you about anything. If they are not talking to you, they will let you know why is that so. If they are with another person, they will let you know why they are with, you know, what is it that's stopping them from talking to you. You can trust this person, but yes, make sure you don't have overanalyzing situation where you are like, you know, thinking negative around the situation where you feel like maybe your person is cheating on you they will not cheat on you they will let you know if they are with someone else or not last card let's see what it has to add <clears throat> finances and career financial uh, issues are affecting your love life right now for majority of you i feel like you know, that's the issue there your person could be busy with their financial situations and uh, they might be traveling for work as well which is kind of you know letting uh, uh not letting them have enough time for themselves even so i feel like you know they would be kind of absent from the connection right now but yes like i said earlier prosperity lies ahead try to keep yourself positive and try to have trust on your person and um yeah that's pretty much it coming up for you for this read if it helps you to like share, and subscribe i will see you in the next read that i'll do for you guys take care bye